In this tutorial, we'll talk about uh, buffering. Buffering is a technique where we can create polygons uh, for a given distance around a feature. For example, in case of points, we can create circular buffers, uh, for example, for, uh, within 10 meters of a point. So in order to start that tool, uh, go to the search tab and type buffer. And if you press enter, you will see a tool named buffer analysis. If you start the buffer analysis tool, you can provide input file. In this case, we will do this for trees, which is uh, a point. And then provide an output file name, which should be, uh, for example, my local trees buffer. And a distance can be given to it. This distance implies how much buffer will be created. So I'm going to create a 20 meters buffer around each point. Now, this can also be done using a field value. For example, you have a column that includes uh, a value of buffer for each um, point. In that case, all points will have their own buffer size based upon the value in the column uh, given by that field. In this case, we're going to have a constant buffer for all the points. And then once you click OK, you will see that a buffer file will be created. You can see it has the if I zoom in, you I can see if it's not a circle, but it's because of the asterisk clicks functions that it's showing like the distance in any direction from this point within the buffer polygon that this be a uh, buffer. So go ahead and create uh, buffers around your line features and polygon features as well. You should see uh, buffers created around. Uh, your polygons and lines depending upon how much distance you gave. This is one of the tools that can be used for identifying area around a feature and then we can use this to find things that lie within that distance around. For example, if you were trying to um, see uh, what points lie within a certain distance of UNLV um, for example, it could be the accident uh, uh, this is around UNLV. You can create a buffer in the points within that buffer. So this is how you do it. We will talk about uh, other spatial tools.